percent. So I already shuffled and split the deck twice. I was trying to work on my PlayStation. For some reason, that thing doesn't want to act right. Check this out. Nothing on the TV. Exactly. So anyway, shuffle and split the deck already. We have ooh the sun, enlightenment, fulfillment, healing, fertility, happiness. Let's see what goes on. All right, it looks like ooh it's been a long time coming, but finally here comes the queen of cups coming in to invest in this happy situation. Yeah, she's still having anxious anxiety and all that thoughts and all that nonsense, but nonetheless. It is finally that time. All right. All right. We're in a heart on our sleeve, ready to come in. No idea what the outcome is going to be. But as I said, she's discerning. She's here. She's ready to move. Let's go. Let's go. Guarded and defensive. We are. Yes, we are. Just a bit. Just a bit. Very proud of this Queen of Cups. Long time coming. With the Seven of Pentacles there. Alright. A little bit guarded and defensive. Doesn't want a heart broken. Wearing a heart on her sleeve. But nonetheless, Six of Pentacles. Hold on, let's do this right here. Six of Pentacles ready to give to the situation that she actually manifested. Taking action in that Queen of Wands. Looking very good. Ready to collaborate and work together. Very stressed out. Very fatigued. Very tired. Some burdens going on. Alright, looks like she's waiting for something. Waiting for her ship to come in. Maybe she's feeling like it's a bit of a missed opportunity. Oh no. Two of Swords reversed. Stalemate no more. No more stalemate. Ready to go. There's movement. There's action. There's the juggling. Even though there is a bit of indecision. We know. We can see. We know where we're heading. Yeah. What is this? The tr to balance out the situation. The Ace of Wands. You want that passionate new start? You want a brand new beginning with the Ace of Cups over there. Very good. I like it. We got over here. Nine of Cups. Emotion of Fulfillment. Mmm. Let's see. Oh, what's this? Two of Pentacles going back and forth. Let's see what she's going back and forth with the Two of Pentacles. What is it? What is that about? Why is she going back and forth? She's hermiting. Researching. Okay. What are you researching and figuring out over there? Six of Cups. Nostalgia. Happy memories. Yes, very good, very good, very good. A romantic offer. Completely seen that while I was going through the cards. Bit conflicted. Not sure how we're going to get to that. There may be other people in the mix, but there's guaranteed movement because she sees a Ten of Pentacles with that. She wants this with that. She sees a Two of Cups. A very balanced, fair, beautiful soulmate relationship. Very good. Oh, wow, this is short. It's only three minutes. We're only going for three minutes. My food just got here, so that's probably why I'm moving so fast. So, two of wands, challenge position. I challenge probably because it needs to be transformed. What needs to be transformed? All right, that burden. Let's see what it was. So, apparently. Putting the swords over here needs to make a final decision. She's a bit wounded, tired, exhausted with the wounded warrior. Can you see that right there? Boop, there you go. All right. About me taking a leap of faith. She's taking everything in her to, you know, keep her composure and all that. Interesting. Page of Wands reversed. Not a good idea. To celebrate. I want to see what that's about. What's this? Three page of wands reversed. What's that about? Page of wands reversed. What is that about? 
Pedro Juan's reverse bad idea was about getting the karmic wheel to spin. Now she's regretful about the King of Cups, the person who captured her heart. Truth and clarity. So apparently she had a plan. She tried to execute and it already backfired. And Ace of Swords are declared to double down on that. Interesting. Anything else we need to know, Spirit? These pentacles over here working, 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 trying to figure something out. Oh, yeah. Holding on tight to the idea, concept. Yes. You may be an empress. You may be gifted, but she's being forced to take a chill pill and rest. Check this out. What's this right here? Mind of swords. Sleepless nights. Thoughts circulating. Ooh. And how am I going to bring balance to the situation? Out of whack. Oh, not good. Interesting. That is the burden that was created. This is why you need to communicate effectively, efficiently, especially if you're a queen of swords. Well, Jesse. Hmm. Okay, so there's delayed communication with the page of swords there. Okay, and it also looks like... There's hidden emotions in this situation. Looks like she's already emotionally invested into the situation, which is the betrayal of it all. How dare you hide from this beautiful gift sneaking around, acting as if you don't know what it is, as if you're not jiggy to what's hip, hip to what's jiggy. Queen of Pentacles reverse. No, that flipped around. That flipped around. Alright, so I guess we can leave that there because my food's here. Oh, yeah. Okay, I guess not. Um, The Hierophant Reverse. What's up with the reversals in this deck, dude? Alright, so the Hierophant. Eight to Swords. Will I be forgiven? Will this be successful? Will we have commitment? Seizing the opportunity. Anything else? I'm not seeing you flip, bro. I know I see you flip. Alright, I guess I didn't see anybody flip. Alright, why are you upside down? Anyway, so she knows who her divine masculine is. She sees it clearly and she messed it up. She goofed already. No bueno, no bueno. It's all good. So, I'm going to check on my PlayStation. I'm going to go grab my food. Get ready for this VOC. And hope everybody has a good night. Love you guys. Love and light.